turn this down. What is popping? It's your boy A Zero, and I'm here with another hot review slash hot take. And I told y'all so. Everyone trying to come online and say it's a hero shooter. It's a no. It's just like X Defiant. Is there's gonna be factions, and it's it's very similar to Halo Reach. If I'm being honest, I told everyone that just because you've seen abilities doesn't mean hero shooter. A lot of times, and I think people are so used to hero shooters that they think everything's a hero shooter. Which I got a video coming out about Concord and Marvel Rivals and how people try to kill Concord and not kill Marvel Rivals. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. We're here to talk about Split the Galate. This um, trailer they gave, which, by the way, I'm so tired of when they do these trailers that they give these people these corny lines and they catch them. Um, got one, got one, got one, got two, two. Over here, over here, he's down, below, below. Like, yes, that is how you talk when you play competitive, but you don't have to always show us that. Just give us gameplay. Just give us shooting, gameplay. Stop giving us the takes on these people that we're supposed to believe really love the game. And The game ain't out long enough, and the game ain't play long enough for people to be in love like that. Chill out. You don't have to do that. But right here, it shows you the breakdown of the classics. It, um, the classes and this one's talking about the arrows where you can run and gun which is um sorry for the text you guys see but um then you have the meridian which is the healer and spotter which is fire like i said very halo reach-esque like if you haven't played halo reach go play halo reach and well go look at gameplay and you'll see it's very close i mean split gate one was already very halo reach but this one well split gate one was very halo this one's very halo reach um, but it looks like it plays like Halo 3. Like, I'm I'm so hyped for this game, man. Um, the gun the gameplay looks smooth, the guns look dope, the little class system they have is fire. This is dope. Like, there's literally a time if you can throw down. Um, and you can speed up your bullets or slow down enemies when they come in. Like, this is so fire and creative. That's why I had high hopes from this game from the jump. Because I was just like, there's so much things they can do. And it just looks so good. Like, give us the open beta, you guys. Like, just give us that open beta. And this class right here, my lord. Dudes are building walls, throwing grenades down, taking our whole team. Like, look at that. Dudes is using what they use on people when they die out and you got to revive them. Watch the shield go up. With well, defibrillators, watch this joint. This is incredible. I'm like, whoa, hold up. Watch this joint. Y'all got to see this, man. I think he does it like like coming up when he gets around this corner. Come on, man. Show it. Look at that. Defibrillator. That's so fire. It's going to be annoying as heck. But if you're smart like me, you're going to have a gate behind homeboy. So right when he puts that down, you can turn around and pop, 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 pop. They're done. Look at that. That's that's insane. Even stop power. Like, if someone throws them and you're all in a room and your team could get ready to die, put that defibrillator up and your whole team's good. Like, I just love the fact that they're going all in with Split Gate. I was wondering if they can get better or more appealing than Split Gate 1. Or like, what can they do that's, like, so significant that it's going to make people say, oh, I want to play this one um, over playing the first one and over all these other shooters that are coming out. And they did everything right. Like, like a lot of people are going to say, that's X Defiant. They can look through the wounds. No, Halo Reach was already doing stuff like that. And so were some other shooters. Perfect Dark. Shout out to Perfect Dark. They was already on this. They were on this stuff way in advance. Way in advance. But yeah, I mean, some of these people aim is rough. I'm not going to lie. But um, the game just looks good, you guys. Like, I'm so pumped for this. Um, they have a, a show they're going to do, like a, a showcase. Um, I think they showed at the end of this. I cannot wait to see August 14th. So we're going to stay tuned. And I'm probably going to live stream that because I really want to put dedication into this game and love into this game because it just looks good. But it is not a hero shooter. It looks class-based, which I'm excited about. And I'm excited for us to get our hands on with it. So we'll see how everything goes. And um, thank you guys for watching. Matter of fact, there's one more thing I want to cover. Hold up. Um, I need this game to... I need this game to show us more variety of maps. Like, I can see that they added some things, but we need more maps. We I, Like, I know a lot of people like just the arena setting, but you got to give us more maps. Like, just imagine in this game, if there were maps that were small, uh, smaller, 
or if there was maps that are like um, big, like like a, a variety of both. The arena's cool, but I want to see some more variety. And I would love like a big team in this, like 12v12, possibly 16 versus 16. Certain little things like that I would love um, to add to this. But yeah, the game looks fire. I'm excited. Let me know what you guys think below. Leave a like and subscribe and leave them comments. And um, I get back to you. Our team, we get back to people the moment you write it. So just be ready. Let us know what you guys think. Um, we're always on standby. But thank you, guys. I will check y'all. Peace.